For best results, be sure to make 12 to 24 hours before eating. To get started on my coleslaw, I am going to thinly slice one to one and a half pounds of cabbage. You could also shred this with a shredder, but I find this more convenient to thinly slice and chop into pieces. So this is what you'll end up with if you thinly slice and chop. Again, you could also shred. Next, I'm going to shred one medium sized carrot and add it to the cabbage. Next, I'm going to grate enough raw onion to use one teaspoon of onion into the dressing. I actually grated a bit more and I did not want to waste it, so I added more, but one teaspoon is all you will need. Now I'm going to work on the dressing for my coleslaw. I'm going to start with three quarters of a cup of good mayonnaise. Next, I'm adding a half cup of milk and a half cup of buttermilk. I just combined them in a one cup measuring cup. Now I will be adding three tablespoons of sugar. If you would like more sweetness to your coleslaw, adjust the sugar. Now I will be adding the grated onion. Again, you only want to use one teaspoon. I just did not want to waste what I grated. I am also going to be adding a quarter teaspoon of onion powder. That is actually optional. I just like adding it for flavor. Next, I will be adding salt to taste. I am going to be adding one and a half teaspoons of salt, but you can adjust it to your taste. Next, I'll be adding pepper to taste as well. And for the last ingredient, I will be adding one tablespoon of freshly squeezed lemon juice. Now I'm going to whisk the ingredients until well combined. Now I'm just going to combine the dressing with the cabbage and carrots and give it a good mix. I made this coleslaw yesterday to serve today with today's dinner and I made a delicious fish fry by the way I have the video for my fried fish I will leave the link below I hope you give this recipe a try I hope you like it because I like to think this is a good place to start <laughs>